This podcast provides a platform that will share many different points of views that should empower you, uplift you, make you want to go out and do right. When you hear the term still a man, say, yes, I am. Still a man. Yes, I am. Still a man. Yes, I am. Let's go. What's up, people? Welcome to another episode of the Still a Man podcast. All right, tonight we are going to discuss they hate me because they ain't me, cisgender. So when I say cisgender, I'm referring to C-I-S. That is an acronym, and that just simply means uh. It's it's you're born a male or female. It's the gender that you was born with, basically. That's what cis- that you identify. You identify the gender you were born in. You uh, identify that's, as. That's that's that's, that's 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 what that's what it is. All right, let's let's get started. Um, we got we got everybody in the house. This topic comes about because another conversation we was having, and uh, Gina said she wanted to um, she basically. She wanted to speak more about the situation, but we ran out of time. So um, I don't know if you guys have seen this um, video, uh, TikTok video that has went viral. Uh, there is a transgender woman basically reading all of um, biological women, the riot act, and um, it, it basically went viral. And then just hilarious, decided that she was going to respond. And then in doing so, her comments angered some members from the uh, LGBTQ plus uh, community, go figure. Um, Don't forget uh, the AI. Yep, yeah, forgive me. Um, they've added some new um, letters on there since the last time we spoke about their community, but for Intent purpose, we are referring to uh, transgender women tonight. All right, let's get started. Uh, everybody and anybody, bring up your questions. The Gregory text you so we can go along. Um, first question, uh, let's go to Gina first. Gina, what is, it, um, what is a transgender? First, pull up your questions, Gina. You got your questions? Uh, I don't have my questions right here. <laughs> All right. Who, who has their questions pulled up? Nobody? All right. I do. All right. What's, Robert, was that you? What was the question again? The, what, First question is, yeah, what is a so transgender perfect. woman? Uh, okay. So I was I was correct. Um, Gina, you can answer that first question. What, what is um, that? A transgender woman is a looking up definitions. You cheat. Oh, hello, <laughs> hello. I'm so yeah, sorry. Just give us just yeah, give us your definition. Mean. Um, is a black bi- is a a biological man that wants to wants to be a woman now. That's a transgender. Okay. Stay or vice that. versa. Well, we're talking about transgender women. So so those are the um, people that's making the transition from men. Right. Right. Um, so, Patsy, what's your, what's your definition of a transgender woman? Um, basically the same thing. A biological man being wanting to be a woman. Okay. Uh, Timmy, same question. You can't, you just can't say you transgender because transgender meaning they did the whole transition. They cut things off, they put things on, you know, so that's that's the meaning of transgender to me. You did the whole transition, not not you know, partially trans 
that is to me that's cross dressing. That's what I call cross dressing. All right, so you so so you feel like so your definition is people that have made that had the whole transition done top and bottom surgery. Yes. Okay. Um, let's go to Gregory. What's your definition of a uh, transgender woman? Sounds like a psychopath to me. Now, um, <laughs> it sounds like somebody playing dress up. So, so that's that's what your 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 definition of a yes, sir. Solid opinion. Is? A, a, a life size doll. That's what they think they are. Okay. Um, sir, what's your definition? I don't really like get into the definition. I'm not really. I don't care to be honest. Transgender is someone again that wants to be someone of the opposite sex. That you've made, like Timmy said, you made accommodations or adjustments to your body to fulfill the full um, level of being a woman. If a man wants to be a man and that wants to be a woman, they're in the process of transitioning. You know, maybe getting breasts, hormones. Um, maybe even going to the full length of, you know, cutting off their penis and creating a vagina. Yeah, once mm -hmm. they, they once they um made that decision, they're truly committed. They are. They, there's no way back. Um, Robert, what's your definition? Is a man transition fully into a woman? That's what they want to call it. So we're going to go right there. And for the a gentleman, before the other gentleman that made that um, comment, you better hope you don't get a dress up that's your nurse. Oh. Um, so what does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> Rob had a physical. He, he, he want to make, sure, he, he make sure you don't get um uh, somebody that enjoys their job and likes to give you sponge baths and they you know, they used to be a man. ain't going to go that far. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, did I get everybody? Or... No, you didn't get Josie. All right, Josie, thank you for joining us. No, Tonya just joined us. And I think Marie. All right, so ladies, thank you for joining us. Um, Tonight we are talking about they hate me because they ain't me, cisgender, um, C-I-S, not S-I-S. Um, so again, let's go to Josie. Josie, what's your definition of a transgender woman? She's not here right now, sir. Hmm. Maria, are you with us? She's not here yet either. Tanya's here. Tanya, are you with us? I am. Okay. Um, what's your definition of a transgender woman? Unfortunately, I didn't get to watch the videos today, and I'm not truly... Oh, we didn't watch your video yet. Okay, I'm not truly familiar with what the proper terminology of it is. So um, what's, your, what's your definition? What's your, what, 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 does, what does the term transgender woman mean to you? What do you... A man trying to be a woman. Okay. So simplify it, yeah. That's right. No sugar. I mean, it's transsexual no. as well. You know no what I mean? Which definitely. is definitely different. I, 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 I just told you what it was because you, you, you can those you got the the ones that's trying to be a woman ain't get the the full transformation. They may not but cross dressers like who Paul mm. or 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 freedom. Now, you know, we're gonna, once you start giving it too they many could, categories, they could be become become transsexual, as like I said. Yeah, transgender yeah. is basically trying to change your gender into the opposite sex. You know, you could be a transsexual and still have a penis and no breast, and you want to dress like a woman, but it doesn't mean you're a cross dresser. You could be transsexual. So, but once yeah. once you have the gender reassignment surgery yes. transition into fully what you want to be man or woman right that's, correct that's transgender yeah. that's and the whole thing they did. that's catfishing so so wait so guys let me ask you this question um so Robbie you just said gender reassignment um so you know there are some uh transgender women 
that I believe it is a, a, a mindset. Um, once they um, identify feeling wise that they are a woman, they feel like that's all it takes to be a woman. How do you guys feel about that? I'm sorry, repeat that. Some transgender, <laughs> some transgender mm -hmm. women feel like that all it requires to be a woman is to have the mindset that you feel like you a woman, so you you are a woman. That's all that it takes. Once you once you mentally decide that that's what you want to be, then that's all it takes. It doesn't really require reassignment surgery, gender reassignment surgery. Um, Tanya, how you feel about yeah. that? Um, a woman physically has breast, vagina, hair. Um, I, 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 that's who said delusional. Um, that's that that can be that can very well be a factor. Me, I said it. <laughs> Gina, go ahead, darling. Um, take that. Um, how you feel about that? Um, that person's uh ideology i just feel like it's 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 delusional it falls in the category of delusion because if a man that wants to be in if if, a, if i had a stalker and he just in his head he just he just knows that i work together and we're supposed to have babies and get married mind you i know nothing about this man but in his head we're together and we're in a relationship and you know that's it so what what you not what what the united states for well, what what the states are doing right now is pushing this narrative of people's delusions and i think it's fucked up. excuse me i think it's messed up well i mean you you that's your no don't don't bite your tongue i mean um you're not being offensive you were just no i just said that because the baby's here oh okay <laughs> um all right, Patsy, how you feel about um that? They feel like that all they have to do is if they feel that they are a woman, that's all that matters. How do you feel about that statement? I think that's ridiculous because if you, you know, if you feel like that you're a woman and in one of those videos, the guy even couldn't even explain what he, his definition of a woman is. Uh -huh. But um, he couldn't explain it. And then he got a beard and he's like, da 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 da, whatever, right? But I feel like, you know, if you feel like you, you're a woman, A, even if you don't have the bottom surgery or whatever to change yourself bottomly, um, at least like look the part. So you're saying, like the you, feel, ones you know? You say, Otherwise, you are not even being a woman. You're you're a wannabe woman by that. You know, a man wanting to be a woman, and it's not even like like how someone was saying, RuPaul. RuPaul clearly calls himself a queer and X. So he one day he dresses in drag, and then, um. Another day he doesn't because he even does that on his show um with the drag queen um um show that he does. Now now let's be quick let's be clear about this. Um RuPaul is uh as a, a drag drag queen. Right. He doesn't, he doesn't identify as a as a female. Shout out to the panel. Y'all using these politically correct terms and scientific um terms and findings. Uh, I heard on um, non-binary, I heard you're, um, uh, can I add to my, my answer? You're a woman if you can bear children. Ooh. Right. Mm. But that's not all women that, can bear children, but it's not politically all women can incorrect. bear children, but you gotta have the ovaries. Exactly. Politically it's incorrect. You can too. be you can be whatever you want to identify as. Politically um, speaking, you can identify as male, woman, nothing, he, she, non-binary. 
Well, no. it could be political all that, you want to, but a, and and, and reality, rea- reality, reality speaking, reality. Jimmy, shut up! Can't hear nobody. You always gonna be who you was born as, but on the outside, you were portraying a, a, a mirage when you putting on makeup, putting on dress, but that's not who you are. On the inside, on the inside, you was born as a man that's dressing up. You so, feel like you supposed so to. So if I identify as a dog, is that okay? Woof, woof. Woof, woof, woof. If, if, a if, human aspect. Like it's, it's, it's definitely. The guys you, are just uneducated and uh, calm, that's all. If you haven't had the operation, I don't put you in that category as transgender that goes for a woman trying to be a man and a man trying to be a woman if you didn't go through the full trans transformation you ain't nothing more than addressing up and you perpetrating you know all right stay right there pause right there Robbie. How do you feel about um this? The, um, they said all you gotta do is feel like you're a woman to be a woman. <clears throat> yeah, I mean that's to each his own. You wake up in the morning, um, <clears throat> you feel like however you want to feel. I can't tell you how to feel. I don't live with you or lay down, with you. so I'm not gonna get into could they or could they not. I'm saying you can wake up and feel like an animal in the morning. That's what you choose to be for the day to each his own. Woof, woof. Um, Brother Sean just joined us, too. Sean, yes. what's up? Um, thank you for joining us tonight. And Dave, mm-hmm. sorry before you go to Sean. You should have add, um, I don't know if they call it trans animal, but that is a gender for them. Um, yeah, that's what Gregory was allowed that's to that's be that's a what, cat and a dog now. That's what Gregory was referring to. Yeah, so it's just not, you know, transitioning to women and men. You transition oh, into a cat or a right, dog. So for, for tonight's for, for tonight's and talk, this is why there was an insane asylum for these yeah. people. Yeah. Amen. That's, that's, you know, now it's getting crazy when you do all that crazy stuff. Hold on, that's guys, because I want to stay, I want to stay on topic tonight. So for tonight, we are referring to transgender women, and we're talking about what brought this all about. There again, Sean, you just joined us. We're talking about the hate me because they ain't me. Cisgender, cis spell S I S. It's an acronym. Um, just simply means uh the the gender you was born with, your birth gender. Um, so uh, but we are talking about in this sense it would because we're talking about uh transgender women, so their their gender is, is male at birth. All right, Sean, we're gonna go ahead and get you what what do you think a transgender is? Um <clears throat> excuse me, good evening, everybody. Um uh a man that wants to be a woman or is transitioning to be a woman. Um, that's what I believe. Oh, that's what I think. I believe that's what a transgender person is. And and, and how do you feel about um, transgender uh, women that make the statement, you don't require anything other than a thought you you if you feel like you're a woman that's all it takes to be a woman um to to each his own i i've gotten to the place where um no i'm still judgmental i don't care um i've gotten to the place where you know people are, are, are crazy and we just have to accept that you know certain levels of crazy requires some 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 attention and others just you just gotta let people be what it is that they think they're gonna be. Mm. All right. So Team uh, your Elijah just joined this. Tanya, Tanya and Elijah's in now. Tanya's already been in. Elijah Yeah, but I got I kicked myself out. I'm back in. All right. So Elijah, thank you for joining us. Tonight we are talking about they hate me because they ain't me, cisgender. We're referring to uh transgender women 
Um, and there is a video that went viral about a transgender woman. Uh, she was basically reading biological women, the riot act, um, as to why she feels like she doesn't have to explain herself about um, who she's chosen to be, basically. Um, and she doesn't care to basically hear the opinion of uh, the so-called uh, real women. So how do you feel about that? And what do you think, what's your definition of a transgender woman? <clears throat> First and foremost, I want to say hello to the panel. Um, my fault, right. I was late. I Good was Thank you. I was watching what was going on with my homeland, Israel. And um, yeah, that's that's what I was doing. So forgive me for being late, number one. Number two, transgenders are human beings. And that's and that's your answer. Yeah, transgenders, listen, I mean, we live in the U. <laughs> I'm gonna say this like the eighth time. We live in the United States of America. A lot of definition will always be spawned up when we're living in the United States of America because we have this thing called freedom of speech, freedom to express ourselves. As long as you don't hurt the next person physically, you can do that. So if a man wakes up one day and feel like he's a woman inside, as long as he ain't hurting nobody, he can do that. And because he has freedom of speech, if Bruce Jenner, who's now Caitlyn, says he's more woman than Joseph. In the United States of America, he can say that. And Josie can also say, you know what, you're wrong. She can give all the evidence. It wouldn't matter. It's just Democratic and Republic. Because we're living in the United States of America, which a human being is first. Huh? Uh, you know what's crazy? Can I say something real yeah. quick? Real quick. Do you know what's crazy? I find that when we when when this topic is brought up on social media, men, men like women, we were. I feel like women are fighting for our our rights and the right to not not fight against fight against biological men that's trying to be women. But men really don't really care. Real men is like, eh, you know, because it's not affecting them. Yeah, because it's not one affecting you guys. One reason is not because it'd be like they ain't doing that because they don't it's want to be called it's, a homophobe. It's affecting us. And no, but it's affecting women. Them. It's affecting women. It's affecting everything that we I stand behind you. I, I said oh, lock them up. I, 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 lock I'm 100% with you. I, I'm with if Okay. The, the, the alphabet is. I'm going to be like y'all just the real The they got one thing. They're not got that to do with dressing. That's women on women. Bisexual is is she like both sex. Now somebody that's gay is supposed to like uh the opposite sex, right? Now for me, trans transgender would be for you know somebody, but since they want to put it now, I I put it as like. Uh, cross dressing, just like queer is cross dressing, but it's all they packed it all in for one. And I'm dying to find out what that AI stands for. There's no, there's no, there's no transgender woman. When I mean women, I mean, I mean, well, transgender men, I should say. There's no transgender men that sit up here trying to, trying to, trying to get y'all right. Uh, that's all I was about but, to ask for you. The trans, the trans, um, the, the men, men, they're not, they're not competing in sports. They're not competing in sports. They're not rushing to go to, to, to run to the bathroom, to, to use y'all bathroom. They're not rushing to do anything when it has to do with men. It's just the, the men. So Gina, Gina, let me ask you a question. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So this doesn't spot a lot of control. Let Gina finish saying what she's saying and then you guys, you can get a chance to respond. Go ahead, oh, I want to ask, yeah, ask I, a question. I want to ask a question, uh -huh. and all the ladies did, all the ladies also. I hear what y'all saying to me, which is crazy. Y'all defending yourself being a woman, but okay, that's the time of age we are. We're in. What should be done? Since every since all these men who's pretending to be women attacking y'all, y'all womenhood, what mm -hmm. should be done? 
Because you're right, we're men. We we probably yeah, we got a couple of chads out there, but they ain't as bad as the way how these dudes are trying to be women or who's saying women. women. What Come men on. men should men should men should, uh, well, it's kind of it's kind of the irony is the men is the one that's doing it. So like I like I I feel like the men that don't want to be women should stand up for us. They they're trying to hold on hold on wait, wait, hold on hold on wait 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 they're trying to change our names. Because oh, she's the birther. She's the she's the, she's the uh the the uh the the the, the birth person the or the uh, uh, the you we know just just really hominids. to we me to me to, to me very very disturbing names that you know no I'm not a birther. I know I'm not the the breastfeeder person. Like I'm the one. I'm a woman. I'm a woman that can get give birth and has given birth. And has can breastfeed their child now they're trying to say that they're you know they can they can breastfeed now i've seen a clip that to, uh the transgender woman said she's taking medication to get uh to get milk and she's showing the camera that milk is coming out of her fake breast oh, like and, and 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 they think that that whatever whatever substance that is in that bottle if it is coming out it's of not that, good that, for it's not good for the baby so this is hold really on. child hold abuse on. Hold on, let's stick to the topic. Let's stick to the topic. Go ahead. I, I listen. Don't get me started. <laughs> get started. Rev that in. Stop right there. Because everybody can't talk at once. That's Timmy Bogart. I know. I know. Timmy. That's some fool. Timmy. What I'm going to need at the end. Timmy. Uncle T, we're going to give you a whole step at the end. Listen, everybody, just listen. What I need you to do, I'm going to say this again. Turn the volume up on your phone so you can hear what other people are saying. So when your name is being called, you can hear. So if you're being called, that means because I want you to pause. So um, let's let's pause for a minute. Elijah, we'll come back to your question. Gregory, let's show that video because I want to make sure. Deanna just joined us too, by the way. What's going on, Duchess? We'll bring you up to um up to speed after the first video. What is this? What video? the guy girl? This Gregory, the first video is <laughs> one that said I can't, I can't the, first video, the first video is the lady, the transgender, that's speaking about why she um doesn't feel that uh real women. Uh, the gatekeepers of uh, gotcha. a female. And then the second video that should be shown right after that is the one where Jess Hilarious is responding. So everybody, pause your phones, hold your comments until after these first two videos are shown. He's going to show them back to back. So they're brief. They're, they're real short. So everybody take notes. Zoom meeting. Zoom meeting. This is what I mean when the transphobia just comes out, the audacity and just the 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 arrogance for cis women to believe that they own periods, that they own womanhood. You don't. OK, you don't own periods. You don't own womanhood. You experience both and both are different for every person. But as a cis woman, it doesn't belong to you. So you can't gatekeep it like hello. This is what I mean when the trans. What if stands up for us and us I mean women real women biological women women who were born with all the parts that you guys wish that you were um when does the delusion stop what is the difference between um you and someone who has been um diagnosed to be mentally insane what's the, the only difference is you don't have a straight jacket on stop talking out your face Wake up. How are you projecting your anger on real women? Because we are the gatekeepers. We are the gatekeepers for periods. We're the only one that can bleed, honey. We're the only ones that can wow. give birth. We make y'all people. We make y'all. Y'all come from us. You can't be us. You will never. You're chasing something you'll never, ever get. You'll never be that. <laughs> All right, pause. Everybody pause. So let me say this um, before we get started. Um, with the questions about the video and stuff like that. Again, people, if you're just joining us, tonight's topic is they hate me because they ain't me, cisgender. And we are talking about the what's causing all this, basically, is the video that went viral, I think, 
don't quote me on this, do your own on research. But I think the transgender woman, our uh, name is uh, Alex, Alexa. So, and the person that gave the response video is just hilarious. Now you got people on both sides of the fence. You got people that are for the um, transgender woman and you got people that support in uh, just hilarious because just hilarious is uh, basically responding. She feel like she's speaking on behalf of all the women that were born women and still identify mm -hmm. as a woman and still want to be a woman and that are deeply upset because they are being told in a sense that they are a sub gender because the only true gender is the <laughs> transgender so that's that's basically what it is and um you know shout out to our uh, sos support our sisters guys this is why you need to be rocking that type of apparel to let the women know that you support them in every sense of the word. Robert, where can they find SOS Support Our Sisters Apparel? Okay. He's 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 slow on the draw. So guys, where you see. can find the latest fashions. You can get that apparel at emporiumplus.org. Just go to any of your um your, your devices and type in emporiumplus.org and you can find the latest brands by SOS Support Our Sisters, You Serum, Still a Man, Adapt the Paris, Adapt the Paris Ladies First, and Envy Forever. Again, Emporium Plus. And guys, um, they got a shirt in there called She Power. That's what we should be paying attention to, She Power, because they, the true women are the women that really have um, the power. Now let's go back to what um Gina was talking about. Uh words that were were um supposed to be uplifting, like um, and, and they was nurturing words where they basically describe the 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 female factor, the female purpose is now being they're they're trying to use these as transition words, words of hate, words to 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 belittle the um, natural born woman, the woman that still chooses to identify with the, their birth um, gender and, and this proud of, 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 of being a woman and having sense. So now you, they're trying to use words like birther and, um, and stuff like that to tear down uh, the, uh, um, the cis woman. So Gina, um, you was responding, well, hold on Gina, let me, bring Kiana up. Um, to, let, let me bring Kiana into the conversation. We're going to come right back to you. Duchess, you with us? Yes. All right. Um, How you feel about that video? How did it make you feel Um, to hear what, the, what Alexa said? Let's call her Alexa for um, intent purpose. Um, and and how did you feel about uh, Jess Hilarious? feeling like that um, she, she was going to be the spokesperson because if nobody else was going to respond to that statement, uh, she was going to be the one to step out front. So Alexis is the video. I, I wasn't on here when you showed that video, but is that the video where the woman, um, trans woman is saying that women yeah. don't own periods? Yes. Okay, yeah. so I saw that video before I came on because I wanted to kind of be a little bit whatever. Good job, good job. Um, I f okay, to be honest, I find it almost a spit in the face of, of biological women to, mm -hmm. for you as a man who believe in your heart of hearts or mind or whatever that you were born in the wrong body, but you were godly assigned a penis to come and tell a biological woman what she is and who she is and how she is is very disrespectful and it's very right. much patriarchal which we the science society that we live in where men have dominated and taken over and told everybody what they are who they are and how they should be um is disrespectful it's disrespectful to your right. own mother it's disrespectful to every other woman biological women, woman, whatever. Uh, as as most females who do have peers, we don't want them. 
but we damn sure ain't going to let you tell us what we can and can't do with it. <laughs> um, so I do um, appreciate Jess speaking up. I know that there's been some backlash towards what she says and and I don't like the term cis, gender, whatever. Right. It, I, again, I find it very disrespectful as a woman. So that's my opinion. Trying to be bite my tongue and not curse and stuff. No, no, no. Um, let me be clear about this, um, ladies. And I'm gonna say this to um everybody. If it's something that you're passionate about, I mean, don't be uh biting your tongue about it. This is the form, it's an open form. Speak your mind. You know, y'all are all articulate, do it in a manner where it's not going to be offensive, but certainly speak your mind. I'm not worrying about you guys using obscenities. I'm, I'm just talking about people going overboard. Um, Speak your mind. Um, Gianni, I think, to, hey, let me say this real quick. Hold on to me. Hold I, on, because I, I, I want to say, I I I wanna hear say from, this real quick. It's real quick. Uh, the, the, the men who were portraying as transgender or those who made the full transition as as a woman, you should be happy and and uh, honored that women are accepting you for who you are or who you portray to be, not you trying to take over and, and push them to side like they don't exist and you, you're the new woman of today. Okay, duly noted. All right, so let's go, before we go back to Elijah's question, Elijah, I hope you remember your question. Um, I want to want to get the lady's opinion. I got Kiana's opinion. Now I want to get um Patsy. Patsy, how you felt about that video? Do you feel like that, um, just um hilarious speaks for you and do you feel like that alexa's um uh statement needed addressing i think alexa's uh, um video didn't need addressing because for you to say that i own a period and whatever right yeah okay i can say i own having a period, do I really want to have a period and, and and stuff? Not really. Most women hate having it monthly, but it, it's a blessing because you can actually have a baby because of because of that, because you have a, that cycle and um you just that ovulation helps produce it. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of like a double-edged sword when you're having your period. But typically when you're going through that, most women, I would say over 90% of women will, if you ask any women, do we want to have that period? No, but we own it because we can actually um, bleed from that. But we could also physically make a child um, because of it. So therefore, for you to kind of like lessen, like lessen our womanhood by saying we don't own that. Hell uh -huh. no, they, a transgender woman can never say they own that. A, Biological women can say, I own that. Yes, we own that. Women, you know, if you're you're not biologically a woman and you went through the transition to become a woman, had the bottom surgery especially, you're just a transgender woman. I'm not saying you're not a woman at all. You're a trans woman. We're bio women. So we're truly by God's making a woman. Well said. Well said. And I, um, I, I commend um the other woman for actually standing up to making her video to debunk 
what the um the transgender woman said. Yes, yes. Is she a comedian? Um, Is she a comedian? I'm not I'm not sorry, I'm not sure, but with when she was whatever she was stating in that video, it wasn't nothing funny about it. She wasn't trying to be humorous. Um Tanya, I yeah. the video, both the videos. I I was offended by what Alexa said um, because um, God created us women to bear children. Mm -hmm. And part of that cycle is having a period. Mm -hmm. And the period is a reminder to be beware, to, to be aware of snakes. Ooh. The snake tricked, not tricked, but yeah, basically he lied to, to Eve. He took from the tree of knowledge, gave it to Adam. And because of that, which is why we, we bear pain during childbearing, but the monthly menstrual is to be a reminder of the deception to be, to be, Aware of deception. Remind me how y'all fucked up. He can say it. No, <laughs> it's, it's, it wasn't. It's, I'm not gonna say. I'm not gonna say that. Apple. I'm not gonna say that. And look at what your name is, Apple. Um. Uh, yes, the iron. The iron. <laughs> uh, 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 Apple. Hold on, hold on. Let's 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 keep to the subject. So Tanya, that is, that's a, that's a hey, Timmy, 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 the woman hold on, body. Timmy. That's all he's doing. He's, he's pushing out the weight trust. There the goes Timmy. There right, goes. Listen, listen, listen. I'm speaking to the ladies right now, guys. Um, um. Let's go to Gina next. Thank hold you. on one second. Hold on one second, Gina. Thank you. Uh, hold on one second, Gina. Uh, Maria and Josie, are you with us? No. Okay. All right. Because I just don't want to miss nobody. Gina, go ahead, darling. It's on you. Thank you for being patient. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm just saying because this topic is like, it hurts me. It really does. It hurts me. Um, well, those the are fact that, words. Those, those yeah, are words you know, and it, it just, everything that we was, everything that my mother taught me about being a woman and how to take care of myself, how to carry myself, all these things, the last 36 years of my life, I feel like somebody's trying to rip it from me. You know what I'm saying? Me bearing my child, me going through the pain, going through the, going through pregnancy, going through all that. It's just nothing. You know what I mean? And I, I'm highly offended, but the fact that this person, you know, I will agree with Patsy when Patsy, Patsy said, if you want to be a transgender woman, that's fine. I'm, if you want to call yourself a transgender woman, do that. But don't call yourself a woman. You have a man on that wants to be a woman on on a video saying, "Oh, we're not the gatekeepers." Like you, like the way it just sounds, it just sounds so childish. You're not the gatekeepers of periods. If we want a period, we have a period. But you don't even know what a period is because if you did, then you would know that you can never have one. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So like. Yeah. And I've seen this other clip where the, a man was like, um, well, we do have a period. We have and we have we have uh, uh, we go through stuff like we go through uh, emotional things and, you know, we go through mood swings and all wait that kind of stuff. Wait a minute. Stop, stop, yeah. Gregory. Wait, right. wait. Go ahead. Seen that video. So, so, right. So yeah, you've seen it, too. Stop. Right. So, so it's just like you're you're describing a symptoms that anyone in this world can have at any given time. You're not saying that. So the, the other person was like, well, do you bleed? And she's like, no, but we get everything else. So it's like a period, but it's not like a period. You need to have a uterus. Your, your uterus needs to shed. You need to have, you, you know what I'm saying? Like you don't have those things. So for you to say, oh, like, and, and, and just like the other ladies on the panel, I don't want a period. I don't. I have the worst periods. And the fact that you're sitting up there saying that you do have one, you're taking up, you're in your head because you're so fucking delusional. You're, you're, you're using all the taking uh, all the tampons and pads off the shelves and stuff just to just to 
uh, uh, pet this ego and this and this delusion that you have that's not real. Like, when does it stop? It's okay. You don't need to be a period. You can have your neo vagina, right? Stick your little thing up there so it won't close, right? But that's the, that's it. That's all you get. Stop trying I to come for us. Stop trying to come for us. It's just disgusting. Hey, Gina. I think hey, you hey. Should sue if they they definitely should have the locked them up for buying all those tampons. Taking up all the OBGYN appointments. Taking I, taking up OBGYN. But I never see. I it took. I try to book a point with my OBGYN. They said, "Oh yeah, uh, six months." What? What? So, so, so let me let, let me pause for a minute because I want to get to the guys too. We we wait. I got to address. So you're you're telling me you're telling me that the um the appointments are are uh, pushed way out because there are. Uh, um, yes, gender, this is real life. They gender, want they gender, check gender them. women taking up slots where where real yes. women should be having these appointments. So for their health wise, yes, okay. yes, it ain't. Yeah, stay right there. Pause right there. Um, Elijah and Timmy. So we're gonna go. Elijah, Timmy, Gregory, Bird, and Robert. Hey. Dave, just let us go freestyles, us guys, man. We ain't gonna be all cluttering right. one another. All right, all right. So, 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 fellas, how you feel about that that video, then? Uh, I, I, I'll kick it off, man. You say you want the smoke without no curse. We're gonna have the smoke. It's all about having sex, man. These dudes right here want to take many dudes, turn them out, and to be in part of their uh -huh. gay parade. It is what it is. Uh -huh. Women, y'all should uh -huh. always be secure about y'all beauty. Nobody can never uh -huh. compete with y'all. Don't even give them the uh -huh. energy. You did what I'm saying mm. to you. Hold on. So check mm. it. If the only thing you can pass this is just stop by showing that you're a woman, because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep it 110. When the dykes came out, men was like, yo, why are you messing with that girl? She Y'all got the same now, but she understands me better than you do. And we're dudes. Mm -hmm. So now y'all having beef with when it comes to these trannies. What I'm saying, especially black women, you keep on holding your head up high. Why? Because you always will be winning. You know what time it is when it comes to the first one walking on this plane. You know what time it is when it comes to sexuality. You know what time is when people came into our colonies and want to rape our woman. You know what time it is. You're the real mothers of the earth. Don't let these dudes who thinking they're who they thinking they women trying to hypnotize the world on you know what we're in competition. Mm -hmm. Nah, that's just an illusion. That's not mm -hmm. real. Look between your legs and look at the man who's beside you. And that's facts. Y'all can mm -hmm. take over. All right, go ahead, Tim. Yeah. Well said. Well said. Yeah. I was getting ready to say what I was going to say women. You have nothing to spare because they can't be a child like you can. They can't they can't have carriers like you can. They can't breastfeed like you can. So you have no fear. It's just like he said about the dice. When 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 dudes was losing their chicks to dice and whatnot. You know, inviting the dice into the bedroom and then she she take over the man role. You know, and, and, and still the dude's girl and whatnot. You know, so... Young M.A., nigga. Way, young M.A., young M.A., nigga. Yeah, so... Dice are trying good. to be... Girl, okay, butch women <laughs> or dice or whatever you want to call yeah, yeah, they, yeah. But here's the, here's the thing. Either way, whether the chick is a dice girl or whatever, she can still be a kid. On the other hand, that man that turns transforming, transitioning, he can never ever bear a kid. So you can, he can't compete with you. He can never compete with you. Just like a, a woman could never compete with a man trying to, a woman that's trying to be a man can never compete with a man because she can never, she can reproduce, but she can never, you know, have a, a, a stick. You know, like the man. Mm -hmm. All right, Greg, we're going to jump in there. I think it makes sense that a person would, come, well, I don't want to say it to be harsh, but a person with no soul would tell a woman that they're not the sole owners of a, a period, the administration. Mm -hmm. That's kind of crazy because mm -hmm. you bleeding out your ass, Alex, and you need to go get checked. Something wrong with you. 
You did not <laughs> use the, what's wrong with him is because he's using his, which, what is an exit as an entrance. That's why they bleed and not get booed. <laughs> Um, but 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 I digress. Um, uh, Hold on, day, 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 day. Check it out, right? Let's be real. Forget about the sexuality between the beautiful women's legs. Their whole mindset, though, the way they think, the way how they see the world, the way how they use the wisdom kit. A man can never duplicate. I don't care if you put on a pair of titties and walk around here with your penis inverted inside. It can never be, dog, because the whole mindset of a woman, that skin, that texture, how she feels, mm -hmm. how she smells, mm -hmm. it's always totally 180 different. I don't get what the dudes messing with dudes, but that's their choice. It is what it is. When it comes to a woman, dog, there's no competition. See how we're talking about? That's giving them energy. Or they falling for my illusion. It's like a person thinking that this person is a superhero because they can sing a beautiful song or this person can fight because he can be in the ring and he can show up at behind closed doors. He's a bitch or she's soft or whatever, whatever. What I'm saying is an illusion, and especially my sister. It's an illusion that a lot of people are, are believing oh, and rolling oh, with. I got you. My sisters... This is where my sisters can just hold their head up strong. Keep on talking, talk. talk. That, I ain't saying shut your mouth. Nah, spit, spit, you speak your spit your speech. What I'm saying is never give them the energy as if they are in competition. They're not. You can diss them all day if you choose to, but they're not in competition. It's impossible. Y'all think not, this. They're, they're listen, not listen to this. They they might be, uh, hold on, a man. lot of women fought for their rights for them to whatever type of rights that they was fighting for the activism. <laughs> it was a lot of women right beside them marching with them at them slut walks and all that crazy stuff. They was out yeah. there yeah. parading with these crazy people. And so it, was, it looked crazy the from the outside and then people was all with it and now it's getting out of control. Right. Yeah, you Gregory. In, in you're absolutely right. A lot of a lot of a lot of females was out there protesting for the rights of these transgender women. They were. They are. They still some of them still are. And you wanna know why? I love being a woman, a woman, but women run off of motions. Oh well, let them be whatever they want to be, as long as it makes them happy. Fuck that. Now, now, pause right there. Um, Bird and Robbie, are you still with us? Because I want to get them back into the conversation. Robbie, Bird, and Sean. Bird, all right. Sean, go ahead. Sean, how do you feel about the video? How do you feel about what, um, what the ladies and the guys are saying on the panel? Um, I, I agree with everybody on the panel. Um, my my take on the was his i mean i'm sorry her name was alexis or something like that yeah we're not uh, i'm not I'm, I'm not certain of her name it so was let's alex just call, let's just call uh, okay her, sorry let's just call her um alexa okay so i i, I look at it's alex i i was listening to what was being said but i my my um problem goes all the way back before i knew anything about transgender this and the other meaning you know uh in my younger days i've always had um, a problem with um, individuals that wanted to identify as something that they're not, meaning the opposite sex. And my, the biggest issue that I've always had with that, and I'm finding it to be the same thing with the transgenders, is that when uh, uh, a man wants to be um, gay, why does he have to be so flamboyant? Mm. And so... For me, I look at transgenders like, okay, you want to be, you want to identify as a transgender, this and the other, but then why do you think your rights and and your and and you know the way that you want to be supersedes what already is? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And, hey, and I just don't. Hold okay, on, let me finish. No, I just want to ask them a that's question. Go ahead. Hey, hey, Shiz, you know um they're building a um a museum here in Boston, Massachusetts, strictly um LBG, whatever you call those alphabets, here in Boston, Massachusetts, right? No, they say sorry, they need, I, I think, that. one something million dollars. I don't know the numbers, but they're building a whole museum that's dedicated to them. Wow. They're going to get it, too. Show me an African-American yeah. museum that belongs to us in Boston, Massachusetts. And wow. that that's is where you hit the needle on the head. That's because it's Boston. That's because it's Boston. And besides um, San, um, San Francisco, Boston is one of the gayest freaking states 
Well, cities. Well, one of the liberals. Liberal, 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 liberal. I hope we have open marriage. Yeah, open. Marriage is, yeah, right. I mean, gay marriage legally. Right. So, yeah, right. I can see it. Well, I mean, liberal. again, so uh, Obama. Obama. Just, just the problems of the world. Of even, judgment. That's all. We have a, but you know what? Well, I don't even got beef. I don't got beef with the gays. I don't got beef with the gays. I'm sorry. I, that's the, that's not where my battle is. My battle is with the trans. I'm I'm what? I'm for the gays. Go ahead, be gay, be married, be, do marry, do whatever you want to do. Adopt Gina. children. I have a question for Gina. Go ahead, Shoes. Go ahead, Shoes. Somebody had a question. Go ahead. Um, and and anybody who may know of her or anything like that, like I'm 52 years old. 52, 53, one of the two. And I still don't understand. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't, like, I, I haven't heard a person explain to me why is it that, you know, I want to keep it on the transgenders, but like I told you how my, it, it's a little deeper for me. Like, it goes from gays to where some of them want to be so flamboyant. And then for the transgenders, why do they think that their way supersedes what already is? Like, what is their thought process behind that? Um, Why is that? I, 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 it's I, a hypersexualized way of thinking. It's hypersexualized. I think, okay. I think that they believe because they've been pushed to the back, to the rear, to the closet, to the back of the line, that they are no longer, they're basically like a train. They're going forward. They, they don't care. They want, they want what they want. They've been in denial all this time. Okay. And they want everybody yeah. to know what they believe and how they believe. And that that's it. What you thought is is irrelevant that, to that, them. That, what that, you that, believe that's is exactly, irrelevant to them. That's exactly that's a good door. That's okay. a good metaphor. Let me show you. I, 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 I like that. Broke it down. Let me show if we're gonna. If we're gonna go with that, then I would say it's a runaway train. So, cause it's like yeah. you either with us or you against us. But you guys, I think there's a word that simply describes all of this. And it's the word that some of them are fond of and some of them find offensive, but it's queer. If you look at the de hey. definition of queer, that's where all this comes from. The whole mindset, the thought, it's a queer way of thinking. If you look up some the powers, people, the powers that up, be, uh, I'm gonna pick up someone. I'm gonna pull up the queer. definition, and you'll see what I'm referring to. This is how I feel. All gay men don't want to be uh, trans transgender. All gay men don't want to be um, um, change their change their sex. All gay women don't want to be men. Yeah, you know, they so, yeah, no, they, they don't. Do. They don't. Yeah, they they do. don't. Yeah, they absolutely do not. Honestly, no. How? How? So how do you think all lesbian females or butch or whatever whatever you want to call it wants to be a man wants to be a a, a, a man? They a male don't. dominance? A male dominance? We can say a male dominance. I'll tell what do you, you. mean? Da Okay, so uh, ma well, masculine well, energy, because they have masculine energy, doesn't mean that they want to go off that, and put. Um, that's that hold on now. That's that testosterone. Hold on now. Yeah, I'm absolutely. hearing double standard. You want the men to defend you all, which I agree with mm -hmm. you. But still, you want the men to defend you all because y'all can't handle these men who's thinking that they're women. Yet, when it comes to Ellen, we can't get no backup. Ellen is not trying to be a man. What the hell what? are you talking about? Wow. Wow. Okay. Okay. You don't know okay. what it is. I've been quiet for a while. Like, Ellen, can I just Ellen. say this so y'all can better really understand, understand you some of things here? Um, I know everybody's going to want to talk over me, but I'm going to be rude and keep talking like you guys do. Sorry. <laughs> now, as I go on to say, nah, it was an open mic, letters, Bobby, you know. They it have was open mic, man. They have these letters for a reason. You got your Al is going to be lesbians. Lesbians do yeah. what lesbians do. Your B is for bisexuals. Those are the people who are doing what bisexual people do. I don't have to keep explaining yeah. these letters to you, but I really want to tell you, the P, pansexual, the I is standing for intersex, the A is for asexual, and Ali, which Ali means we, um... You the 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 queer, they have two Q's 
for you people that might not right. understand what queer means. So they tell you the the other way, and they call it question. I'm, so, I'm familiar with that. Yeah, I'm, I'm familiar. So, so, with that. When we they, already when, know whoa, 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 whoa. when they do these things, there should be no debate. Does this man likes women still, or this lesbian or transgender likes a man still? You know what they like by going through the definition of which each but, letter but, but, but you're, you're right but you're putting the, every letter in the same category of their beliefs some no some no, 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 men, no, no, wait, no 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 wait not wait hold on hold on hold on wait wait you're saying that, that this is the lgbtq plus blah blah blah, blah. okay i right. get that but every but the the b's and the and the g's and the l's don't always don't it's not agreeing with the t's and the well, a's on, and the g's and everybody else Hold on. Let's take let's take the basic, right? Sexuality is made for reproduction. I don't care what letter you letter you are. If you're having sex with the same person, you dig? It's still, you know what I mean? It ain't producing anything. So when it comes to a woman who's sleeping with a woman, she's trying to be a man. And when it comes to a man <coughs> sleeping with a man, one of them's trying to be a woman. You dig you what I'm it. saying? It's all about yeah. sexual. I don't care how their culture is. I don't care what their belief yeah. system. It's I, still one is dominant over the other. I disagree. They're doing, not, it, they're doing I, it for I, pleasure. I, they're not doing it for procreation. I, Stop I, it. Right. Have exactly. So, honest, thank you. For, pro, for pleasure, thank you. not for procreation. Let's stop it. Thank Cut you. It it again. A lot, there's say a lot of, again. there's a lot of, say there's a lot of. Say that again. I didn't say it. I didn't hear it. Which is that pro, procreation is not for I what? Said, have, they're not doing it. Sex are doing it for, for pleasure, not procreation. You must not hear what I said. You must not hear what I said. I said, when it comes to sexuality, we know it's about procreation. That's what I said. Look at the animals, look at the plants. When it comes to these people, whatever letter you want to put them under, it's about still same sex, no procreation. When they're doing that, the style of that sexuality is one is dominant and one isn't. That's a male and female trait. That's what they're imitating. And because they're mm -hmm. imitating that, they have in different countries to write to imitate. What I'm saying with sisters is I don't care what the letters are. It's it's all about sexuality in the sense of oh, this is. But why do you think Ellen wants to be express themselves? Why Hold on, guys. Hold on. Pause. Everybody, pause. I kind of agree. Hold on, Timmy. Hold on, everybody. Everybody, pause. So what I'm saying to you is what I said to y'all in the beginning. We got six questions. We only got to to the first question. Someone no. the second question, please. <laughs> Anybody got their questions in front of them? Here's an idea. Everybody open up your questions. I don't even got no damn questions. Tanya, do you have your questions? Gianna, I'm getting them. Everybody open your questions and keep them open, please. Uh, tech person. Okay, so question two? Yes. What is a, what is cisgender? Did we go through that already? Yes, we answered that. Yeah. That question was the three? Wrong. Question three, what does the term fish mean when uh, transgender refer to biological women? We went through yeah, that. Yeah, that's the next, no, we yeah, didn't. That's the next question, because this is right in line with what we're saying about this, um, the, about these uh, these words and stuff, about how things hurt. And Offensive. All, uh, and they the try, to, re and, and, they try and, to recreate them and re to find them. That's what they Fish is to derogatory. Find. They're gonna, disrespecting gonna, us in our face. They play that. Right. So we're going to start with the ladies wow. because guys, you can play cleanup. But this right here, this question, um, again, what when, okay, ladies, when you hear transgender women refer to you as fish, what does that mean? Is that offensive to you? Or is it's it offensive. Of <laughs> it's offensive. I'm sorry. Kiana? Why the hell would a fish be fun and daring? There's nothing, there's nothing um, beautiful about a fish. Maybe the color and that they can swim. So are they trying to say the and smell? And, rude, and they're don't trying to it. talk about the smell. And too, and, and yeah. not only transgender people use that, gay people use that too, but go ahead. Mm -hmm. um, Patsy, how do you feel about that term fish? Like, this is the first time I really like I've never heard anyone 
whether it's a transgender or whatever. But to think about it, it's fine to call me a fish. You, you're transgender. How are you going to call me a fish when this is a natural born, God given quality that He has given not just me, me but other biological women? Nah. You are wanna be fish women to me and my idea. So fish because we get our periods. Fish because we get our periods. Fish because we we have uh you know women's things going on, you know, so they wanna say that we're fish, so we're nasty. Oh, you with that fish? Well, I'm better. I don't bleed, I don't do any of that. I just I just got a hole, so you can do whatever you want with me. I'm 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 good with that. Fish is my favorite dish every day. You can feed me that. I'm, I'm good. I'll fish because you're officially a woman. I, I, all I the fish. fish every day on my plate. I, Excuse me, ladies. Is this <laughs> something how these people can have some names for females? <laughs> fish? Oh, man. <laughs> that should get me in tears. Baby right. girls, do not go for it. Do not fall for the energy. Y'all know why, well, what time yeah. is when it comes to y'all pH balance. Oh, you know Don't what? fall for it. You did. So, so, Robbie, your, your, your uh, residential um, devil's advocate, you usually play devil's advocate, and I know you did some research, some extensive research. Um, what, what, does, what do they mean in the, um, in the LGBTQ plus community when they use this word fish, this term? My guy, you're going to say we didn't call on you. Um, I didn't even try to research that. I'm just going to go based on some, some, somehow the way these people think. And I shouldn't say these people, but I'm going to say these yeah, people. Yeah, let's be clear about who you're referring um, to. The, the, the community that, that shares a lot of letters. I'm going to tell you, they're probably insinuating fish is something natural. Um, something that's God put down here in the waters for you guys. So when a woman is coming out the womb, she's she's naturally born as a woman. So they call you fish. I I went back to when I was talking to Dave a little bit a couple of days ago yesterday. I even told him this. I, 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 I'm excuse me. You can actually sign after I get done. Um, they straight up the men and the women. You know when they lost somebody, they go back out there and, and you know. There's plenty of fish in the sea, plenty of fish out there for you to pick from. No one had a problem when the men was calling women fish, and no one had a problem when the women was calling the men fish. Go back out there, there's plenty of fish out there in the sea. So when a uh, transgender does it because they're gay or they transition into what your sex um is, man or woman, you hold a great problem with it like they have coming to you being offensive, um, disrespecting you, saying really, why don't you just think like the way you say, I'm going to go back out there and get out there and go fish me something else <laughs> up. Fish. No, but there's a problem there. They're using it in a bad way, that's the way you perceive it to each his own. Because if they calling themselves a woman, are they a fish? Or are they going to say, I'm a trans woman, I'm a trans. <laughs> um, um, uh, Sean, what do what do you think about that? Where 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 Rob is said in the word fish? Do you do you think that when when those representatives use that word that they it's a term of endearment or is it to be offensive? Uh, I I <laughs> to me, I think it goes both ways. It all depends on who who's using it. Um, mm -hmm. because I, I, I'm, I'm going to piggyback off of Gina's thing. Like some, some of those that are in that category, they don't all think the same. Mm -hmm. So I'm, I, I'm, I'm, my answer is, um, it all depends on who's using it and how they're using it. Okay. Fair. That's fair. So, but the ladies, y'all in the greens, you feel like that's an offensive term. Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. What's the next question, Tanya? Yeah, because you can't ask me about oh, wait, Timmy, wait a minute. It was never good. Say, say it again, Kiana. 
I said the history behind it because again, this is the word fish pertaining to women is not, not a new. This is not new. This is old. Yeah, that's old. That's so, old. So, 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 ladies, if you're gonna take that stance, educate them. Educate them. Tell them. Tell them why it's offensive. Because you said it has well, its origin. No one has ever said that to my damn face because they would have right. been educated <laughs> and freaking chin <laughs> But no, I've heard it. Yeah. Yeah, I've heard it too. I've I, no, no one's ever said it to me, um. But I've I've heard it. I've heard it used in the in that community, um, specifically trans. I mean, I'm I'm sure some other people for in, in the letters say it too. But I don't think any lesbians say it. I've hung around tons of lesbians, and I've never heard that ever. Um, no, I've heard of. They just they just you know what I mean eating the fish like a man. That's all. Uh, uh, in the fit, but you do you understand yeah. how that that even that sounds offensive? First of all, I'm being sarcastic. Uh, uh, what I'm saying is this. Right, but I'm just yeah. saying. <laughs> I'm saying so can I say this, this? Right? one of the women said earlier they're referring to that because um they're making fun of the way our vaginas smell, smell like fish or bleed like fish. Um, West Indian ladies and West Indian men, they don't say fish, so. I guess next, if the transgenders pick up the word the West Indians use, you, you guys gonna be offended about that too. They call their nannies chicken. Go clean your chicken. So there's such thing as chicken of the sea, not just tuna fish. So you know, I think that so, depends on what island. I've never heard that. I don't care if somebody calls it. I've never, I've never heard somebody say chicken. Go clean your chicken. No, I, I actually looked that up earlier. I actually looked that up earlier in Jamaicans when they used. I just told you, Jamaicans and Trini. No, no, no. I've been around both of them, and I know what they said. I've dated a Jamaican from Jamaica. He's never called my 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 poom poom. I dated a Trini from the hometown. And guys, just so we clear, I wasn't agreeing with Rob. It. What I was going to say was what I read was Jamaican people refer to fish as gay men. That's mm. what they refer to. Oh, uh, wow. Right. They call gay men fish. Now, do y'all see a problem with that? Because now they ain't calling hold on, women hold on, hold on, hold on, fish. They calling the men fish. Bobby, I can't speak. Bobby. I can't, yes, speak. Bobby, I can't speak for gay men. I'm not gay. I'm, I can't speak for gay men. I'm sorry. Bobby, Bobino, listen, you can't add a different culture into the culture of the United States. These dudes are calling females fish. And Jamaican is calling I mean, that's guys Jamaican. Period. We're the United yeah. States kid. That's yeah. all. Yeah. 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 Listen, our country is multi. As multi, they are buck breaking. No, people. no, they're they here. Bobino, the, yeah. the standard. You got to know the standard of your country. We got a culture. Our culture is the United States. Yes, it has an ad of a lot of different people culture. And they say right here, hold our on, hometown. hold on, hold on. When you when you was when you're born in the United States, you are totally different people, kid. Totally different. So you can't relate to well these these alphabet people is making up their slang for their culture. And compare it to a Jamaica or Trini culture. You can't do that. Why? For the simple fact is that's a different culture. To me personally, mm -hmm. with the Trini or what they, whoever you want to call them, what they're saying is offensive. What I should suggest, I can't really suggest because I'm not a female. Yet, for me, if it was a box determination, because y'all know I'm You can make suggestions. You can make suggestions. Hold on, hold on. When if because I used to box, when it comes to me training a female, getting at these people, keep on standing on how they're not. Not so much defending yourself. You know who you are. Defend on what they're not. And that's how you can, you know what I'm saying, to make your stance. Because only thing, if not, you have to put in laws. The law is you cannot separate. You cannot put this to that. And when you put in that laws, then that's when it's going to be a big situation. Because that civil rights laws says Bruce can be now, you know what I mean, Caitlin. You know what I'm saying? And if Caitlin want to talk trash about their sis <laughs> gender, you think what I'm saying to you in the United States again? I'm suggesting with me personally, women keep on talking about on how they're not. You can't have no baby. Oh, keep on, give them names. Shoot, they giving y'all names, give them names. They you know have one. 
fake men. I mean, fake uh, fake women. There no, you that, go. That, that there might you be. Go. No, no. Let stop right there because I'm about to say something. That might be the, the starting factor. That they're mm -hmm. fake, they're fake men to begin with. See, right. That that's what I think part of the problem is. They didn't fare well in that gene pool, um, um in, in, in that gender. So now they, they want to go ahead and conquer the, the, the so-called weaker <laughs> feminine um, uh, gender. Because you was born a male and you wasn't dominant. You you didn't you you couldn't be or or you 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 um you didn't choose to be or you you didn't see you you felt like you couldn't compete. So now there's, there's you all like kinds of reasons go why that man might they not didn't go get medication uh, and go see a psychiatrist uh, or a psychologist and get this all, thing underway. That's what happened. They, up, lock them up. They didn't know. go get the treatment that they needed for their mental health issue. And we there's there's know. people and this, all these people are just feeding into it, saying, "Well, you can be with a When does it stop? Right, you guys got to be very yeah, careful. Yeah, yeah. We all Everyone know. that brought a kid into this world should be very concerned because this world, as you see it, they made it so it can be this type of stuff going on. Um, transgenders, bisexuals, and all that. Your children whoa, 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 whoa. is living it's in this world. Wait, they got to grow wait. in this world. <laughs> Listen, I, I don't, don't know what that is. But... Mommy <laughs> time you give them or daddy time. When they leave your home, they're going to be making some choices on their own. Absolutely. All right, now pause right there. And listen, Uncle Rob, that's well, why on, I think on, it's Gregory. bad to support Gregory. that community in all. No, because no, it's no, a no, hyper... No. Listen to what I'm saying. It's a hypersexualization of everything. You no, got people that want to change their gender because of their sexuality. You got people that want to be called something different from other people because of their sexuality. They just want different titles. It's like a crazy entitlement thing going on with the whole community. All right, so Dark, this is what I'm saying. Down. Wait, everybody pause because this is what happens. When, when I'm calling your name, like again, like I said, I'm trying to get you to pause for a moment because I'm seeing and hearing something you're not. Timmy's been trying to get back into the conversation for a moment now. So you know if you don't let him in, what's going to happen when he does get in? Let me go ahead and say what you <laughs> was trying, <laughs> trying to say. Say okay, what? Oh, now, we all know that when they say fish, they talk about the cleanliness. So like my, my man ECMP said, he smelled fish. He knew he wasn't fishing, but he smelled seafood, right? So that means the chick wasn't clean. Her her plot of the JJ wasn't clean. She didn't do Okay. You know, oh my God. <laughs> that's what that's the bottom line when they call a chick a fish. That's the right. way I take yeah. So her, so again her, her, but JJ wasn't clean. So that just supports what the ladies were saying. It's not a term of endearment. They meant for it to be offensive. That's the reason why they're using it. I, I, again, I don't think these people uh um all of them are that bright. I don't think they do extensive um research. And, and figure out, yeah, this is a scientific word for this and that. I think that they use certain words because they're trying to be coy about the things that they say. Yeah, Dave, I'm they're there. trying to be, Dave, these are still men at the end of the freaking day. I, I know Dave. that. I said that they, earlier. They, they, so you got to still think of men. Don't let those fake titties fool you. Listen, it's psychology. <laughs> that that, does, that doesn't yeah. necessarily mean, that does not necessarily mean that these are an intelligent bunch. Just because no, hit me on that, that baby. Whoa, 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 whoa. I never underestimate, you know what I'm saying, the other side of anything. Check it out, kid. Listen, it's all psychology. I'm just saying to my sisters, I can't I can't talk for white women. No disrespect. I dealt with sisters. I'm saying with my sisters, keep on talking about what they're not. That's all. And give them names if you want to fire back at them and keep on winning as you've been doing. You know you're the mother. You dig what I'm saying? You got, hold on, you got a haplogroup group and a DNA to show it. You know you're the mother. You know you're the birth. You know you're the life giver. So what, what you jealous because I'm fishing? You can't be? Yeah, I bet you, you know what I mean? I mean, go, I mean, go in at it, but it's all psychology. They make you feel insecure because why? They're still mm. doing man attributes. And don't they ain't making me feel insecure. They just, that they, they, what they're doing is trying to delete uh, women as as as, as, as they, but they are. Have you? But that's why you do. 
Look at look at the look, like look at the stuff that they're trying to do in law. Look what they're trying to do. Listen, okay. sodomy so, is used in mind control. I was just gonna These say people that are kind of um a little bit slow after they have had these but anal this is things. Out here. In the world. Tiana, you're gonna have to say that again. Your phone so, jumped if you out. have enough people circulating and saying it and pushing for an, an agenda, they will end up being law that now we're gonna be called cis. Well, none of us like that shit. And then it's right. gonna be law that, um, you know, now in your birth certificate, you won't check male or female. Male or female. Check exactly. I it. agree with you all. So you, I'm asking you, you all. I agree with y'all, ladies and gentlemen. Well, now, hold on, you T. Hold on, T. You hold on, T. You hold on, T. I agree with y'all 100%. This is why I'm asking you all, the ladies, the question, and have heart for this. What law would you want to be made? It's y'all. What law? Say it. I don't want y'all to say y'all want me no more. It should be a law. Say it. What law yes, should be we, made? Yes, we're saying that. That's what Jess Hilaria has been saying. That's the whole video. That's what she been saying, y'all. Y'all no, not said women. A you law. Can... I said no. Nah, I'm law. with you, not cause. a statement. Not a statement. Up. A law. Okay, but you know what? The I thing, wish there was a law, but you know they're not gonna let that happen. You don't know that. You gotta make it up. Go ahead, Okay. Go ahead. okay. Can I they this? need to be diagnosed. Oh, Gregory, let Gregory say what she's saying. say. If you were born a man and you transition and had bottom surgery to say that you're a transitional woman, the law should say that that you on your birth if you re if reassign yourself in on yeah excuse me on your birth certificate if you're gonna change the gender on there or on your license if not both. That it should say trans. Trans woman. Thank you. Thank they, you, they, Patsy. They, they Thank you. Hold on. Thank hold you on. for that. Hold on. Thank you, Patsy. Hold on. Hold on. Thank you. Patsy for president. Hold on, hold on. You asked them a question. Woman. You got to let them answer. That's the woman. You're a trans woman. If you went from male to female and did all the hormonal surgery to get your breasts to be bigger and to do the bottom surgery. You are a transitional woman. Thank you. I am a woman. So if there's going to be a law passed, that's what the law should be stated. As okay. Be okay. Preach, on. Patsy. You better hold preach, on. bro. Hold on. Hey, Patsy. Hold I hear what you said. Hold on, hold on. Everybody pause. Patsy, are you finished? Yes. Okay, wait. Tanya? Yes. What question are we on? On um, question... Read it, please. What is gender? Oh, no, that's four. That's what we have. We have four. What is gender social construct? That's what we did. We basically, Kiana, just, um, Kiana, say what you said again about what they're trying to do. Oh, you mean run a train on us? Um... No, no, darling. <laughs> the part about what you said, they're trying to make people believe a certain way. Well, they, they, they want people to believe what they believe, and they're not taking no for an answer. Or, I mean, if you say no, we don't agree, you're against them. Not not that you just don't believe, or we can't agree to disagree, but no, you're mm -hmm. against us. You're trying to yeah. hold basically, us back. Basically, hold on, hold on. What basically, our enemy. It's not even a, it's, yeah. it's, it's either a yes or no. Basically, yeah. it's, 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 it's exactly what I've been telling you guys about your race. So these people told you was black, you're black. These people told you that's a fly, that's a fly. This is an orange, that's an orange. That's white, that's blue, that's grass. That's dirt. That's water. They named everything. And you all repeated everything, and that's the way you learn, and now you say everything they taught you. Yeah, but the things, but but see, yeah. here, oh, but just, those people are saying I can't. that. They know what they they say. Know hard about dirt and water. You wouldn't That's know what dirt was if they didn't tell you that was dirt. Well, here's the thing about that: when you get to you a certain point in life, some shit grows off the ground. That's the same thing they do. Everybody pause. Everybody pause, because you can't. 
You can't hear because soon as somebody starts talking, everybody starts talking at the same time. Timmy, go ahead. The, the, you have dirt in person's oh. grass and water. <laughs> that is all the things that is essential to the earth to our survival. Okay, you know what construct so means? That's, that's why that's why you have the, you, they say grass and dirt and all that. If the caveman been knew about that, about dirt, grown shit. Uh, you know, so it, 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 it's just what it is. You know, uh, but you can't say that that the people, uh, they said this is what it is. This is what every Every that's what they call it. Um, Let me answer pause, Uncle Will. Pause, pause right there. Hold on, Gregory. Pause right there. Because let's go to this third video. Because I think this, yes, go. This is, I think the third video is going to answer exactly what we're talking about. Gregory, uh, Gregory, answer Robbie first, and then go to the video. Gregory. Now I was saying that Uncle, you messed me up because I started looking for the video. Um, but to Uncle Rob, damn, you, I'll come back to you, Uncle Rob, because I don't forgot what the hell. Right, oh, yeah, what I was saying was, listen, go to the video, go to the video. Listen, no, no, listen, black people, once they started oh. calling us black people, you can't remove that term. So these people have removed the terms that they was calling them, and it's okay. So it's a difference. You can't just bring that into the water and just. Say that like that. That's that's messed up, bro. All right, so let's so, so before anybody else responds, <laughs> let's go to the video and let's see if this sheds some light on, makes it things everything's clearer. Everybody, hold your comments until after the video's over. Zoom meeting. Women, real women, biological women, women who were. I didn't hear anything. Your definition is that a woman is someone who is female, you said, right? Correct. Gotcha. Is okay. a biological female. So what happens if we have maybe someone who is female, identifies as a woman, right? You know, cisgender woman, right? As you explained, as you just explained, but maybe doesn't have the ability to reproduce. Maybe doesn't have those organs that you're talking about that are reproductive organs. I have answered the question. You stood up here and said trans women are women. Yes. Tell me what you mean. What is a woman? Womanhood is something that, just as Ethan explained, I cannot define because I am not but myself. you used the word. So what did you mean when you said trans women are women if you don't know what it means? Right. So here's the thing. So I do not define what a woman is because I do not identify as a woman. Womanhood is something that is an umbrella term. It includes people mm. who... That describes what? People who identify as a woman. I identify as what? as a woman. What is that? Was to each their own. Okay. Each woman, each man, each person is going to have a different relation with their own gender identity and define it differently. Pause. Everybody pause. Everybody pause. Um, Gregory, you said I got one question for the panel. What's missing from this discussion? What did you say? A womb man, a real exactly. woman, a woman. Exactly. And ladies, I got you would have picked up on that right away. What is missing? No, no. I, I, my phone was on mute. Mm -hmm. he, 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 he trying, he he's trying to. Hold on, Timmy. Oh, Hold on, Timmy. Yeah. Hold on, Timmy. I asked the ladies, what's missing from that conversation, that discussion? A woman. First, a woman. Go ahead, Gina. You can be first. And Key, you gotta turn your phone up, dog. No, go go ahead. Go ahead. I'm sorry. Go ahead. My phone's not up. It's all the way up. Um, yeah. I said. Yeah. I, I said first of all, what's missing from that conversation is logic because he did not answer the question. It, it 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 isn't according to every woman what the term woman means. That's just the that's that's a asinine way to not answer a question. To be coy right. and to 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 leave it open to interpretation. So and, 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 there was no logic in their conversation. Pause, pause right there. Pause right there, because I don't want to make you lose your train of thought. But just for visual purpose, what, what, who were all? Was it all men in that video? Yes, it was. Yeah. Yeah. And, and, and just just for visual purpose, no. did they? Wait, 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 wait. Tell me, tell me. Listen, listen, listen. For visual purpose. 
Describe the individuals in that video, Tanya. Two men with beards. <laughs> Two men with beards. <laughs> was, was, men. Did, so, 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 was, was, well, any, was any of them dressed up? Was any of them masquerading or representing females? Yes, yes. I, got, I got the guy that one, was the one, one that one. I told you earlier. He okay, no, beard. but I'm not asking for me. He I'm got a beard and he's in, dressed in, as a woman. If we have any blind um, viewers, no pun intended, but I'm telling you, what are you that's looking? why I told you, Dave. <laughs> Oh, describe Lord. describe the, the panel members in that video. Dr. Phil, a doctor that was working for Dr. Phil on his show, that was talking to the guy mm -hmm. that was dressed yeah, as a woman talk. with a beard. Okay, so that's that's. I just want to be clear about that. Now back to the ladies. Um, again, so it's clear that there was no female representation, real female representation. Am I correct in saying that? Yeah, correct. Right. All right, now for the uh, now back to the discussion. Now, um, go ahead, uh, Kiana, Gina. I, I just uh, was saying, I mean, it, it's to ask a person who does not deal in in the biologics of a female what a woman is is an again another backhanded slap in the face towards right. biological women. That's right. And, and, right. and it's actually getting on my nerves. And it should. Right. I've seen, and I've seen that whole, I've it's seen that right. whole interview. That was a Dr. It's Phil right. interview. Right. And there was, go ahead, Gina. Go ahead. I, yeah, that was a Dr. Phil interview. And that, that man, I forget his name. I think it's like Walsh or something, but he has a, he has a documentary called What is a Woman? And the funny freaking thing about it is, None of these motherfuckers can say what is a woman. And they say it doesn't make you a woman just because you have a vagina. Yes, it does. Huh? Well, I'm sorry. You're not a woman. That's why they can't tell you what a woman that is. is. With that word is right. not a woman. But that's, that's woman. exactly woman. what they, what, that's exactly what this, these transgender oh, people are oh, pushing. They're pushing this saying, saying, oh, well, just because that you, you have a vagina doesn't make you a woman. Just because you have a dick doesn't make you a man. It does. It hold does. Hold on, but but hold on. That's the psychology. That and that's very interesting. Where he, when the dude couldn't, and why it was all dudes in the panels because nobody can answer the question. What, what is a woman? When he said it's a, a transgender is a, a a man who feels like he's a woman, act and perform like a woman. Yet he's not a woman. Yet he feels every sense of a woman. That's a whole made up mental That's a contradiction. Uh, idea. That's and no a doubt contradiction. It. No, it's not. No, it's no doubt. But, but hold on, no, hold not. on. But but this is where this is where laws get very interesting. That's why I asked the ladies what laws should be made up. Because by him standing on that principle, and if he get a rally of people. Yeah, they can come up with their own death as they've been doing, which is, is gender under, social construct. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. But it's yeah. under it's under the social or should I say the civil rights act of laws. So what I'm saying to the ladies is y'all need to stop real <laughs> fast to start developing a, a standstill or what is what because now we're living in a land that say that whatever I want to identify, I damn near can, even if it's copying the real. And I'm suggesting ladies, especially sisters, stop preparing to oh, imagine a loss. Because this is going, I won't say out of control, this is going out of control. This is crazy. This is just wow. You know what I'm saying to you? And 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 all the y'all ladies need to get together and stand together and put it on writing. On this is what, yeah. and when it comes to this and this them, bump it, this them, don't hurt and them. It's bad because they're ready to take your kids over that. If you go to the schools and complain about the kid not being a girl and he's but a little girl, you might lose your kids. Because in, in the wildlife, hyenas are the only hyenas that can transform in from a male to a female. If there ain't enough males, a female would turn into a goddamn male in the damn hyena world. 
So but we're not true. animals. We 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 not animals. We supposed to be. We don't animals. happen with hyenas. That's the lie. That only happens with frogs. But it, it's not just frogs. Hold on, Patsy, trying to say something, guys. Good, Patsy. Okay. In, in in comparison to that video with what that dude was saying about like he couldn't divine a woman with that ideology. They they um in in some um the law spectrum, that ideology needs to be shut down and say no, we cannot with your idea of non definition of what a woman is, uh, what even what a transgender woman is, they 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 that kind of law should not even exist. It shouldn't be thought of. It's because they keep giving them these platforms. And if, and, and again, what Kiana said earlier, if you say it loud enough, long enough, proud enough to to um enough people, that's going to change the social they got, they got too many, they got money behind them. That's all they, they definitely do got money they, behind it. There is they there got is money behind them. They're in high positions to bring in more people of their kind. Mm -hmm. They like they like you know the the nationalities that come into the United States, and they only hire their people of their own race or whatever. Mm -hmm. That's what they do. All right, Dave. Let me ask you a question, Dave. Hold on, hold on. What, before we do that, hold on one second. Um, Tanya, how many more questions we got, darling? I think it's like one. Dang, can I comment on a video real quick, Uncle B? Wait, let me see how many questions is left. Two. two what's the two, please? Should transgender women disclose that they were born a uh they were born a male when meeting someone they plan to date and yes sorry we all let her finish let her finish and should transgenders be allowed to compete in female sports? All right, we're all going to say hold, no. Hold anymore. your question because it's important that we get to these last two. Hold your question. Let's do a yes okay. and no. Right, Dave. Yes or no question. All right, so again, um, Timmy, can you wait until we get it out? Yeah. But I want to give a question before you ask the question, Dave. We're going to go to Timmy first. Go ahead, Timmy. Since you don't want to ask you a question, Dave. You're going to ask a question. It's going to take away from the last two questions. Just let us get these questions out. Go ahead, Timmy. Got you. Yes. Oh, shit, shit. Should, who was it? So women, uh, men. The transgender women disclose that they were born a man for dating yes. purposes. Yes, and no, they should not be able to go into a woman's bathroom unless they can prove they had the full transformation. That's no, it. it's complete. <laughs> don't, don't worry about it, Tanya. Don't worry about it. Sean, go ahead, Sean. I'm sorry, ask that question. Sorry, one more time. Sure. Okay. Um, should transgender women disclose that they were born a male when meeting someone they plan to date? And go ahead. Okay. And should transgenders be allowed to compete in female sports? All right, go ahead, Sean. Yes and no. Yes, they should. Um uh, disclose. disclose disclose what they were prior, and should they be allowed to compete in female sports? No. Okay, easy answer. Elijah, answer those two questions, please. Um. Yes and no. Reason being. Oh, okay. Um. Um. Yes, for the simple fact is, is if um <laughs> if a person is having sex. It shouldn't. It shouldn't be. It's an old school movie. It shouldn't be the crying game. You know what I mean. And and that can cause um a Jenny Jones. And no, because you know men is going to be always have <laughs> some type of um way of 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 being a woman physically because he has the mental of doing it first. And that's why. Okay, G Gregory, answer the two questions, please. Yes and no, because. It goes back to that fish word earlier. They be catfishing people if they're doing that. So mm. it's kind of crazy. They try to call women fish. And no, be, no, because they just shouldn't be competing 
against women, period. Go your ass and compete against the men. You're a man. You're a boy. Or oh, start your own game, Hold on, Timmy. Hold on. Oh, start That's your own league. Hello. Hold on. You have I'm your chance. They're about to yeah. start a game. Start a football team, basketball team. Robert. Start a whole goddamn league. Timmy, let me uh, answer the question. My answer to should they reveal who they are um, since birth, I think yes. I say yes all the way. They should let you know that there was a uh, man first because it's your choice to continue, you know, whatever y'all got going on or what's going to have going on. The second question, um, should there be, um, what, allowed into female the pop- Female no, to compete in female sports. I say, I say completely no. I the reason being is because if you guys can raise a million or millions of dollars to build a um museum or whatever you guys are putting together, you can take that money and build a whole new league, a whole new sport in Boston. And build it in Boston. And gay. They probably always got it work. No, I think that's fair. If you can use money to build a museum, you can use money to build a sport for you, too. All right. That's fair. Um, let's in talk Boston. To hey, Dave, I had a question to ask. I know, but wait, G, I mean, hold on. We didn't We didn't get everybody on the panel to answer this question. I said I'm going to oh, get I apologize. Chance. My fault. I um, didn't want to lose. Let me write it down. My fault. Gina? <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm here. Last two questions, though. Um... Um, no, they should not be able to compete in women's sports. Um, that's, that's and, go ahead. Right. Sorry. I had, I had to answer, baby. Um, no, they should not be able to, um, compete in women's sports and you should disclose that you either had a peen or a gene before you started dating somebody. That's, that's, that, that's, that's catfishing. That's, that's, that's just. That's, that's lying. Yeah, that's lying. Mm-hmm. And then, my, mind you, I see this nice, handsome man and found out they don't have a penis. I would be very upset. You should be. <laughs> but hold on, but hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got, I got to get it out. Well, Isn't it on, all you got, lying? You gotta, you gotta, you gotta hold on. There's a method to my madness. Now you're about to take away from me. I'm, <laughs> I'm about to give you your your spotlight, but you keep messing with the ball. Um. <laughs> Go on, uh, Patsy. Yes, they should disclose it because if you're not a true, actual woman, you're going to get your, your face popped in. Mm-hmm. First of all. And then with the whole sporting things, no, you should not be on a sporting, women's sports, anything. And like everybody else said, they should get like a transgender gaming um, situation going on, whether it's uh, a transgender woman um, games or transgender male. Gosh, just give them the whole Olympics. Yeah. <laughs> well, they, they need a whole section of sporting events. They can put the whole alphabet out there community in there. Hold on, let's yes. finish. Yeah, they just need a whole transgender sporting arena for whatever sports y'all want to they want to play. Okay. Nicely said. Kiana, then Tanya. Um yes, absolutely you should be fully disclosing that you were a different sex prior to because that's a waste of someone's time. I mean, if I wanted to have kids and now I now I'm I'm in a relationship with you and you can't have kids, not because <clears throat> you couldn't have kids because of some reason, but you were, you were never you. going to have it's a lie. So our base our relationship was based on a lie. So no, you should absolutely have to disclose that information. And no, I don't believe that children or adults, children or whatever should be playing in a sports with the same trans sex. No, I just disagree with that because biologically men are stronger. So if we're in a competition 
and you're always number one, I never had a chance because you was a man. So no, absolutely not. Mm -hmm. Tanya? Yes and no. That's it? Yeah. All right. right. Elijah, ask your question. You got one minute. EC. Roger. Now, you see, now, you see, Jim, <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. The minute is up. Now, <laughs> hold on, give me a second. Second. I, I, I have a, I have a, I have a question then. Um, you guys are really concerned about this transgender situation so hard, but pay close attention. Um, the the new letters to their LGBTQ or whatever it is called was A and I, and you have AIs out here sitting in arenas watching football games. People are taking them on dates now. <laughs> that the yeah. the reason for that AI is you know uh, the I stands for man. intersex and the A stands for asexual. That's what your new president of the United States of America is going to be. Asexual. I mean, and do you know what asexual means? Let's not get off the topic. Let's not get off the topic. Let's not get off the topic. Y'all was doing so good. Elijah, ask your question. Elijah, ask your question. All right. First of all, I was going to ask you, Dave, do you think it's all about basically not just in... um not just including themselves in a culture, in the way how they love each other, but most of all, take, I won't even say taking over, but dominant. You got to remember, these are a lot of people um, who have been uh, uh, feeling like they've been, you know what I mean? They're tired of being victims. They're tired of being bullies because they love to do what they do. Uh, yeah, not, not to us, not natural because it don't reproduce. Anyway, that's number one is they basically invading culture with this, which is an old ancient Roman Greek type of way of doing things in the sense of for success. Like, for instance, the fashion world, 70 percent of them is, you know, they, they're part of the alphabets. Or when it comes to behind 90%, the scenes. 90%. OK. And when it comes to um, doing movies and TVs, you know, it's about a good 50 percent of that. So when it comes to culture. And pumping out culture, and yeah, I believe it's a Piper effect going on, but also it seemed like a um a, a payback. Yet, and this is the second question: when they saying um the, the way the culture, the way they do things, this is what keeps me in perspective. It's not real; it's all fake. I don't care if ninety nine people believe it's real. I will always hold, I stand on my square. It's all fake to me. Mm -hmm. It is what it is. A woman is a woman. A man mm -hmm. is a man. There's no competition when it comes yeah. to my brains of thought when it comes to that. There won't be no, well, maybe. Nah, nah. No, That's all no, I got to no. say. Uh, okay. uh, answer right. this before you fade away. <laughs> Explain a woman is a woman, a man is a man. I'm Aphrodite. That, that, that. It's a Come man. On, answer that. that, is, that is okay. I would tell you. No, 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 Greg, we don't you. say anything. We don't say nothing. I would tell you. I would tell you. Let Elijah answer it. God. A woman's God. a woman. With, a man's a man. I, I know you're saying with the same order. Guys, yes. Guys, you see a whole day don't have no respect for the question. You're doing it again. You're doing it again. Let me get him the answer. You're about to start a whole nother show. You're it's not. It's the, the it's the same thing. Answer it's that question. Thing. I'm about it's to answer it. Show. But go ahead, Elijah. I'm, I'm going to permit you to, to answer the question, but we're going in a whole different direction. But go ahead. Sidebar. This is going to be a quick sidebar. I'm going to say it again. What makes a woman, yes, we already know about the physicality. Yet yeah, the main thing that makes a woman is her mental, is that brain. Her brain will produce things that they will call estrogen, which men don't have. We got testosterone. They only got wow. a little bit. We only yeah. got a little bit. And because of that mental, they think different. They see things different. They experience the nature, which, which is their sister, or should I say their mother, which is the earth. Men can never do that. Why? We came up out of them. We don't understand this. So when it comes to that, they got the same organs. All right cool enough you got a p and you got a d i mean check this out when mm -hmm. it comes to that mental 
you're mm. gonna bring out that fem, fem, feminine in the sense of if you do if you do have both you produce a, a child well we know case closed you dig what I'm saying to you because you can produce a child out of you now you put it in it if you put it, a child help Produce a child with that other opposite sex or a woman, and you you dumped and she got pregnant. Well, we know you operating as a man. It's all about that mental, you know what I'm saying? But I don't. I haven't seen in science that uh 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 uh, uh, uh he she, you know what I'm saying to you. No, get the same you know, hermaphrodite. Okay, no, no, hermaphrodite. No, no, he, he wasn't talking about hermaphrodite. He said a he she. That's why he talking about hermaphrodite. hermaphrodite well, let's say hermaphrodite. I never he's spread talking about into transgenders. Dave, he's seen... talking about hermaphrodite. No, he's I never not. Seen... He's talking about transgender. He's saying, what are you uh, talking uh, about? Uh, hold, hold, on, okay, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on, hermaphrodite. What Thank I'm saying you. with the hermaphrodites is this. I never read on it. He, she is not. Let's be clear about this. Dave, he ended up calling it that. That's why he know that. Listen, what I'm going to tell you. You want oh, to be shit. ignorant? You want to be no. ignorant? No. So Robert already checked me. I said whatever Dave, I wanted to Robert, say. Mark Dave, Dave, oh, my gosh. Dave, <laughs> Robert already checked me. Let me keep on flowing ahead, right quick and end it. So when it comes to, um, I never read anything that Hermaphrodite can have. Uh, one can produce a, 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 a daughter coming out of her, it, 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 working as a woman because she got two genders. And then all of a sudden, all of a sudden she um, or he, you know what I'm saying, to work the other part of them and they produce a, a child with another woman. I never read anything like that. I'm a firm yeah, believer it if it work comes out. Way. Bound. I'm a firm believer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If it's like, Let's just, more hold, on, hold, on, hold on, hold on. I'm Not a firm believer. I'm firm believer. It's like a mule or a donkey. It don't reproduce, or if it do, then that's the main gender. Even if it does have two genitals or two different type of things between their legs, it's whatever they produce, or they just sterile like a, a mule. Okay, can I keep, can I make can I simplify this so we can end the show? All right, thank you for y'all's analogy, y'all's insight. Now let me be clear about this: ignorance is no excuse for allowance, because none of us or as ignorant as they will lead you to believe that you are, you shouldn't allow none of this stuff that's going on. Y'all want to keep throwing the word around queer. The simple de definition for queer is odd. And this whole way of thinking is odd. That's why, again, Kiana, what's the saying? You can't make sense out of nonsense. And that's exactly what this is. This is a bunch of um, nonsense. I when, agree with you, Dave. When, when, when God set out to give any assignment, if there was an uh, assignment, the whole purpose of reproduction was to create man and woman. That's why it was a man and there was a woman. You needed one of you need one of each. You needed a female and you needed a male. And that's why he gave those terms female and male. And that's why those are the words that we use to describe the different genders. But you require both of those genders to procreate. You can't do away with one or the other. And one can't decide they're going to be both. And it definitely can't be the male species that decides that he is going to be both. Because if it could be done by one, then he wouldn't have made two. This is the Superman Podcast. Thank you guys. For See y'all next week. God bless you.